Hello guys, you're welcome to another exciting edition of our program. It's Link Up with DNC TV and trust me, you're hanging out with your favorite host, B to the U to the STA Buster. And right here we are in, uh, we're in Beggar and we're right here with an amazing act in the person of Fawazi. Amazing artist he has been, you know, great, great visuals he got. You know, go check him out. He have a lot to say. So if you're not here, you're actually missing. Let's go meet with him. What's up, my brother? How you doing? Yo, Buster, what's good, man? G? I'm, I'm fine. It's always good to have you. Yes. yes. DNC, I'm happy you guys come through, man. Yeah. So for Wazi, I have been, you know, longing to ask this question about that name for Wazi. You know, it's actually... A beautiful name. A lady would always want to say, oh, Fawazi, how are you? You know. So uh, how did you get the name and want to get to know your real names? Oh, yeah. Oh, my name is Fawazi, just the way you know, man. Okay. Ladies love calling me Fawazi. <laughs> it's easy, easy. It's a beautiful name, man. My real name is Fawazi Brahim. Wow. You know, but when I came to the entertainment lifestyle, I was like, man, I don't need to be in Fawaz. I need something sensation. I need something that people can uh, relate to and it sound good. That was how I came up with Wazi, man. It's a beautiful name, though. I love the name. <laughs> and and the name is actually kind of unique, you know, kind of unique. Okay, now, um, Fawazi, um, I want to know, you know, your project so far. I know you're planning for something bigger coming. And I um, want to know uh, for how long your consistency have been in the industry and have you been able to drop, you know, singles after singles? I know a lot of people or will be asking about more jobs and they're hungry to hear you out and they're hungry to see your face on the screen. So what, what do you have for us or what have you been able uh, to drop so far? You know, basically I've been doing music for quite a couple of years now, but um, I got uh, started working with Streetwise Record from 2017. And uh, that was where I dropped my first official video. And from then, I will tell you from 2017 till, till date, I've been dropping songs back to back with good videos. You go check out my songs, uh, Normal Level featuring DJ Neptune, Consign You featuring Magneto, Karashika, and back to back, man. I've been doing great for myself, trust me. That's, that's amazing. You know, as an artist, a lot of people, mostly in Nigeria, Lagos most especially, we have artists that you know, you've not heard about. A lot of people that are talented due to one thing or the other, you're not hearing them. Maybe money, um connection you know knowing who to work with and all that so to you as an artist how do you manage to push yourself through how do you manage to keep yourself still consistent in the industry despite the whole huddle you know a lot of artists pass and at the end of the day they get frustrated and they dump it and go do something else so how have you been able to keep yourself going you know just the way you said there are a lot of talented guys out there man there are so much talent out there and when you everybody is actually waiting for support and I tell you, basically, nobody wants to support anyone. People love to support people based on pity. They see you, then that is how maybe before, you know, yeah. based on pity, now people they support people. Yeah. But I tell you, man, you just have to believe in what in your craft. You just have to put the energy in that music. You put the energy in yourself. And trust me, when you be consistent doing that all the time, People definitely come to support you. They will see no reasons like, oh, mom, we could show this guy love. You don't try. But once you just sit down, you know, if people want to work with you, you have to be the ones to work with yourself. Yeah. People love to work with people who works for themselves. Mm -hmm. Nobody wants to come and just like, okay, come, I'll make, I'll make. I'm all too many talents out there everywhere, I tell you. <laughs> so you just got to work for yourself, man. Yeah, I, I want to know something. You know, um, a lot of people out there would want to get educated. You know, we educate ourselves every day, every now and then. Yeah. Does talent alone guarantee an artist to be who or she wants to be? Of course, it has to be the talent first. Okay. If there's no talent first, how do you want the finance to push yourself? Okay. It has to be the talent first. Okay. When you're talented, I tell you, there are a lot of opportunities out there. People are really want support. And then uh, money is really important as well it's, it's a very key to the talent sometimes the people who have talent they don't have support financially they get lost at the end so the boat goes the same way mm -hmm. so you need the boat to push so to you which which works for you 
Trust me, man. It's all work, I did tell you because <laughs> <laughs> your talent alone. I'm, even the person who won't push yourself, now your talent nine guy money push you. Exactly. So you see, in that's always. Yeah. So oh, that's, that's, that's <laughs> you, because you need data to post for Instagram. Exactly. You need other things. <laughs> and uh, that's uh, yeah, more. So exactly. you see, I'm back. Yeah. You know, in life, a lot of people, you know, have their embarrassing time. You know, some people will tell you they're performing on stage and the next thing they are trust at all. And they don't know how they don't know how to turn. They will use scope. They go back band and all that. So to you, what has been your embarrassing moment? You know that you can never forget as an artist. Uh, <laughs> I will tell you. Uh, there was one day I was in um in a a co hotel. Okay. I was about to perform. Uh, I think it was an um, MC Shakara show. So I was supposed to go, and then uh, they start playing someone's song. Wow. And then when I was supposed to go to the stage, they said, no, be your song they play. Ah. So I got <laughs> lost at the back. Yeah. So, but I didn't take it as an embarrassment all the time. Whatever, whatever comes to me, man, it, it is what it is, man. That was what was meant to happen that moment. That's how it's meant to happen. So I don't need to feel anything embarrassment. I'm all, if I don't feel anything embarrassment, when I take a look at myself, I just cock up my shirt, man. I'll like, let go of it. Hmm. You know, in your in your craft, uh, would you love to, or have you in any way worked with a female artist before? Oh, basically, no. I've not worked with a female artist, but sometimes when we're in the studio recording, man, there are a lot of female artists in the artists. Yeah, they're in the studio. Okay. We vibe together and we do other things together. So, but uh, having a song with a female artist uh, that we drop, no, it has not. Okay. It has never been done. Yeah. Fawazi, I know you have or you should be planning something for the fans this year this is 2022 yeah. and uh we'll have double of you know doses of music from you so uh what do we have in stock like what do you have in stock for the fans what are your plans for 2022 what are you doing in order to make sure your fans don't get you know tired of listening to you uh for real i'm seeing 2022 as the best year ever i'm sure this year is going to be the most beautiful year ever not just for Fawazi, but for the entertainment industry as well, and to the world as well, because the previous few years was really bad, man. Uh, so I am um, I'm about to start with an EP, dropping an EP for the 2022 with uh, six songs, um, an amazing, beautiful songs, <laughs> and an, an EP title, Energy. Why do I choose to title that Energy, man? Because I'm putting more hard work, I'm putting more attention, I'm going to put more, like I'm coming in full force, so I put all my energies in that song, in uh, my EP. So uh, amongst amongst this amongst the EP, do you have any favorite you know uh, track amongst the six you know uh, listed tracks on the EP? I'm not gonna lie to you, man. You see, I put all my energies on the songs. That is why the EP its name, its title, energy. There's no favorite song for me there. All the songs are my are like the best to me mm. there's no one i would say this is my most favorite this no, all of them i love them they're all beautiful songs wow. did, did you produce any do you because i know a lot of artists they produce their jobs you know they want to impute with the producer or the person mixing do you in any way produce your job no i didn't produce any song on that uh i have like three producers on that ep so i think they the guys are an amazing guys man so I'm happy with the jobs, what they did on the EP. They okay. made justice to it. So like when when is the EP coming up? Uh bro man, we're dropping on February, man. Straight up. And this is the February now, man. So we're dropping straight. We don't no what, time to waste. Dates? Yeah, I'll, I'll give you a date, man. But I'm more just believe see this February, man. You know I love uh, and I love time with this. Yes. So a lot is <laughs> coming up. All right, guys, you, you'll be having a lot to hear from Fawazi. So you guys have to stick around. You know, you go follow him, official Fawazi on Instagram, and get more insight about what you're about to see from uh, Fawazi. Yeah, so Fawazi, you know, um, how do you entertain or how do you work with your female fans? I know uh, your female fans will disturb you a lot. You know, like you said, you're fly, you're cute. And the whole ladies out there want to be around you. And your energy, the EP, is a, a, you know energetic song that every lady and every guy out there will love. So how do you deal with your female fans? You know, my female fans, I'll tell you, man, I have a, I have a very serious female fans. They knows, they knows 
like the, the kind of people, the support, they know the ambition. So they are the people, my female fans are people that, they're very straight forward people. Mm. They know the ambitions and everything. So man, I tell you, when it comes to my entertainment, they are very supportive, they are very encouraging, and uh, they give the massive support and love to me. So I think aside that, uh, I don't think there's any other thing again. Okay, guys, you heard from him. It's your boy, B to the U to the S, the A booster. Don't forget, it's still DNC TV. Link up with DNC TV. And that's why we're linking up with Fawazi right here. You know, and uh, I believe everybody watching in UK there would enjoy every bit of what's happening right now in Nigeria. DNC TV. It's all about entertainment.